what Prince William, Princess Kate and other royals carry on their flights. The British royal family has been praised of late for their down-to-earth approach to air travel, with the Prince and Princess of Wales often spotted flying with British Airways alongside their children. Like many of us, members of the royal family have certain items they simply cannot fly without. While recent years have seen the firm opting for more humble travel choices, the same cannot be said for days gone by and the same goes for their royal travel essentials. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Despite their more grounded approach to air travel, the Waleses do have one major royal must have when they take to the skies, one of them being ultra chic matching monogrammed luggage. William was previously seen sporting a travel bag with the initial W on it, but just in case it isn't obvious whose luggage belongs to whom, the royal clan also uses large signs in different colors to help them differentiate. The late Queen Elizabeth II had exceptionally glamorous requirements when she flew. According to the Telegraph, an uncovered treasure trove of memorabilia from former flight attendant Elizabeth Evans revealed that the former monarch liked a martini before her guests arrived, according to notes dating back to the 1970s. Canapés were also served when the Queen flew with guests. Meanwhile, the late Queen also liked to have a bowl of sugar-free velaments beside her during takeoff, reportedly enjoyed by President Ronald Reagan as well. The Duchess of Sussex previously revealed a plethora of interesting items she always travels with in her now discontinued blog, The Tig. One tip she shared with readers, was allegedly passed down from Leonardo DiCaprio through a friend. A dear friend of mine once told me that Leonardo DiCaprio gave her an excellent travel tip, she wrote. Adding, he said that to avoid getting sick on planes, he puts a little neosporin on the inside of his nostrils. Not only does it create a barrier for germs, it also lubricates the skin on the nose. Another must have shared by the former Suits actress was to always travel with something cozy that smells like home. I never travel without a scarf or thin cashmere blanket that feels like a hug, she wrote. Throw it in your purse or backpack, and no matter how far you travel, you will always feel comforted both on and off the plane with something that feels and smells like home. Megan also loves to have cleansing wipes and hand sanitizer to wipe it all down, specifying, that includes the little TV, the service tray, and all the buttons around your seat. The British royal family has been praised of late for their down-to-earth approach to air travel, with the Prince and Princess of Wales often spotted flying with British Airways alongside their children. Like many of us, members of the royal family have certain items they simply cannot fly without. While recent years have seen the firm opting for more humble travel choices, the same cannot be said for days gone by and the same goes for their royal travel essentials. Despite their more grounded approach to air travel, the Waleses do have one major royal must have when they take to the skies, one of them being ultra chic matching monogrammed luggage. William was previously seen sporting a travel bag with the initial W on it, but just in case it isn't obvious whose luggage belongs to whom. The royal clan also uses large signs in different colors to help them differentiate. The Prince and Princess of Wales have reshared a heartwarming tribute to Princess Anne in honor of her 74th birthday on Thursday. Alongside a touching trio of photographs, originally shared by King Charles and Queen Camilla, the royal couple wrote on their official social media account, wishing a very happy birthday to the Princess Royal. The montage of snapshots included a black-and-white throwback image of a young Prince Charles and Princess Anne enjoying a picnic in the grounds of Royal Lodge in 1954 and a joyous image of Anne beaming at a 2023 Buckingham Palace garden party.